Olá amigos, tudo bem com vocês? Hoje eu vou falar de um case, uma empresa fantástica. É, eu vim a conhecer ela no final do, do ano passado, mas ela já tem mais tempo de vida. Mas ela pegou um nicho de mercado, um mercado especializado e que pouquíssima inovação ou uma visão muito tradicional, que é o mercado de meia. O nome dessa empresa chama-se Stance. E eles estão absolutamente mudando, chacoalhando esse mercado. São meias de muita personalidade. Então ele tem uma base de, de, de pessoas que ajudam, que colaboram, de colaboradores. É, então tem a Rihanna, tem uma série de outras personalidades que estão ali contribuindo e tem é, as suas linhas específicas. Então hoje eles são fornecedores de meia para a NBA, então alguns jogadores da NBA usam. Eles são licenciados Star Wars, então as meias Star Wars são feitas pela Stance. Estão presentes aí em mais de 40 países, inclusive aqui no Brasil. Tem uma loja aqui perto de nós, na Augusta, se alguém se interessar. É, deixo com vocês aí um vídeo contando um pouco mais sobre a Stance. Sipping Duce, boy, this ain't your daddy yet. He in the Cadillac, me, I'm in the Maybach. The same gray sweatsuits and white two socks. This is black leather pants and the pair stands. The people that are most inspiring to us are the people that really don't pay attention to the rules and stand out. For us, it's about communicating a lifestyle that we value, which is centered around originality and self-expression. The business rationale became, let's find an initial product category that everyone else is ignoring. Usually when my wife mentions where I work or when I mention, I usually get, are you kidding me? You work for Stance? We really define the culture as uh, two parts, it's freedom and accountability. Everything's very comfortable. It just kind of flows from being at home to coming to work. The biggest benefit of Domo to me is how easily it calls out a red flag. The first impression was beautiful. The colors, the aspect of it, the ease of manipulating it. I'd say if I sum it up in one word, it'd be magical. One thing that I love about Domo is that I can set alerts and I can ask the system to alert me if any KPI goes out of a tight boundary that I put on it, which allows me to spend more time at the beach and ignore everything else that's just happening how it's supposed to. I'm in the office, I'm checking Shop Eat Surf, Wall Street Journal, checking my Domo dashboards. It's, it's become part of my morning routine. It can do anything, it's limitless, and I can see that in the beast moding. You know, being able to write a formula that if I don't have an attribute that I need, I can build it in beast mode. But with Domo, I'm automatically getting that data in real time, extracted out of the software, and put on my desktop. When I wake up in the morning, that's the thing that I click on, because I want to know what's happening in the business real time. I do get an occasional call after hours, or email where somebody needs something really quick. The great thing is I don't need to get my computer out. If I don't have it on the tip of my tongue and I don't know what it is right then, that's something I can easily quickly get on the app. In the past when I would present spreadsheets and we'd walk through it, you know, there'd be some glazed eyes. And now when I bring up a Domo dashboard, everybody's laser focused on it. I actually think the four corners on your iPhone say a lot about your personality. You know, to sum up my love affair with Domo, it's my bottom right app.